Hey Bizarre Marketers, it's Tim Summers. There is a trend going on that has three layers they're calling it. So it's uh, for your social media posts, Instagram is the main one that's been using them a lot. So you're taking uh, the same picture and making three different cuts of that picture, layering them on top of each other, or three different pictures and layering them on top of each other and make one image to upload your social media. So I'm gonna show you how to do that today, real quick and easy in Canva. There's two ways to do it. And then I'm also gonna amp it up a little bit and we're gonna slide a video into one of those layers and just show you some options that way as well. So let's get into it. I'm on Canva right now. And you want to select the social media one, which is a square. And I'll tell you, I'll show you the little harder way first. So if you just go to photos, and I'm just going to use pizza. Now you can upload your own photos in here. I'm just going to use some of the stock, uh, stock ones in here to make this quick and easy. So we're going to just grab, uh, you know, three different pictures of pizza here real quick. So we'll grab this one. Grab that one, and let's grab that one. So now to make the three layers this way, it's a little harder because you got to try to make them all the same size. Just kind of grabbing them there, and then just editing them this way, and then you're gonna pull this out. So it's pretty easy this way, but you want to try to make them all the same size so they fit in here. So there is a grid that makes it real super easy, which I'm going to show you next. This takes a little more time, and you just got to like see that bottom picture is not the right size. So it takes a little more effort this way. So you get the idea. So let's uh, clear this out and add a new page. Get rid of that. So if you go over to the elements, there's going to be a section called grids. And here you can see that there's all kinds of different grids. And this is the one we want here. It's got three layers on top of each other. So you just click that, it pops it in there, then they're all the perfect size. So now we go back over to your photos. And let's do let's just do pizza and see what comes up different. Yeah, here we go, some bigger pizza. So now you're just gonna grab these and drop them in. And grab one more here. So there you have it, three layers pretty quick and easy. So it's, you know, one of those things where people are using all these different layers to, you know, they have different scene or the exact same scene and then they just cut it into three different sections. So really taking it to the next level though is adding a video in one of those. So I'm gonna go to the stock videos here and just put pizza in. And let's see what we got for a pizza. I see somebody cutting a pizza or serving one up here. There it is. So now if you drop that in the middle, so now you've got an awesome three layer thing. You've got the two stagnant pictures on top and then the video there. That's a pretty amazing social media post if I do say so myself. So that just takes it to the next level. A lot of people are just using the three different layers, three different pictures. Um, you see a lot of selfies where they've got you know themselves in three different poses in the same background and they just kind of stagnate across there. So it's really powerful. It's really fun actually, and it gets a lot more attention than a basic uh, one picture. So give it a try. Canva is a great tool. There's a free version. They also have the paid version, which we use that gives you a lot more options. Like a lot of the stock stuff in here uh, comes with the paid version. Uh, but with the free version, you can just upload your own images, which is basically what you're going to want to do anyway. Um, if we wanted to add a logo on here, you know, we've got our clients in here. We just we'd stick one of their the logo on here as well, and uh, you know, really make a difference there. And then you know, you got the logo in there. So Canva is a great tool if you're not using that to create your social media post. You need to start doing it. This is Tim from Bizarre Marketing. I hope you have a great rest of the day. We'll talk to you soon.